So people, I am back with another Riders Republic video and today we talk about customization and monetization within Riders Republic. I can see, <laughs> you can see my badass looking Dini Dino saw there with my ice cream. I don't even know how I got this, I must have won it, but it's pretty cool. It's pretty badass. Now a lot of people have asked me about uh, the microtransactions within this game and do you think there will be uh, a problem? Me personally? Well, well we'll talk about it, we'll get into it, I'll showcase you what's available what you can do to your character uh, this and the other and then show you guys the cosmetics you can buy for in-game currency as well as something that's called RC which is probably going to be called Riders credits or Republic credits or something like that. But before we get into the video, guys, if you do enjoy it, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so upon first loading up the game, you will have to create your character, your avatar. Now, you can't specifically make them look like a dinosaur like this, but you can see my She Hulk underneath that costume. Now, that's who I created. Now, you can uh, re edit your character via coming to Riders Ridge, basically the social space, the social hub. I see all these crazy bastards doing these back flips and front flips on his little old school. I don't know what is he doing? <laughs> but you come to Riders Ridge and you come to trending. This is where all that good stuff happens. So you come up here, go into the shop menu, and to further customize your character as well as your gear, your outfits, your emotes and avatar. Well your avatar is right here so I could go on to edit my character if I want to. But I like my She-Hulk appearance, but there's a lot here. If you haven't seen the customization in this game, there's a lot here and there's probably going to be way more added within the full game. Because remember guys, this is just the beta, uh, the demo even. So yeah, there's probably going to be way more within the full game. So yes. Oh, I just, what have I just done? No, that's what we want. That's what we want. Okay, so you can also do your emotes. Um, you can equip four at a time, I'm guessing here. And there's, I mean, like it's just it's an emo and people. This is just standard this kind of game. Podium finish as well. So if you finish first, you can you know. And you can see these are all got rarities to them. There's no doubt uh, because these are all the standard green rarity. There's no doubt going to be better ones you can unlock too. We have outfits, and you get an outfit for each kind of race there is. So you got air, um, exploit toys. You know, this is just the craziness this is just like when you're in the run standard you can wear what you want um, but you got air I can't go into that night it's locked can't go into snow race or bike tricks or in terms of snow tricks if well I'm uh, on the skis or snowboard I can dress how I like just apply it here and then when I go to bike race I can look a different way if I want to and you apply that here too so it is pretty simple we then have gear in terms of the, uh, your bikes and this that, and the other and you can semi customize them here I believe I mean I haven't had too much of a look at this but um, actually I think you just equip them here I don't know if you can actually customize individual bikes and things they can just equip what you use here I'm guessing which is pretty cool like that's probably how I got this or got that on I don't even know how I got that on <laughs> just surprise me when I pulled it out but yeah, in terms of your character customization, your gear, and the way you look, uh, you come to trending within the uh, Riders Ridge social space, and then just go to customize at the top, see home, then customize. Now, if you go all the way across to shop, we have a shop here. Now, we've got pre order because obviously the game ain't out right now, so you can pre order the game if you want to do that. We've also got the credit packs which are unavailable now known as RCs you can see up there top right next to my name and it says gravity the fire and I've got my box which is the in-game currency I've got 67,000 of them they are really easy to earn but they are within the demo anyway next to that I've got RC within the demo they gave me a thousand uh, of these RCs which I'm guessing everybody got but I've used them already uh, then if we look we can see the daily items we have here which rotate which you can purchase with both your box you know that green currency right there or you can use rc now it's a, quite a lot more of your box and it would be the rc which makes sense so if i wanted to purchase that i'll just click that simple as that people and like i said these rotate daily 
And you can see there's a much better emote there, which is a expert emote. That's pretty cool. Um, how much mean, you know how it goes, people? You know how it goes, people. Standard stuff here. And then we have seasonal. Seasonal things, people. Now these, some of them you can purchase with both your books and your RCs. Like you see, one, two, three, four. We've got five here, well, four here, which you can use your box on. This one here has got a 30% discount for 1500 RCs. You get five items. Yamaha Electro Green. So you get all of that. Which obviously you can mix and match your gear as well, by the way, guys. So if you want to wear this helmet on that gear, you can do that. Uh, but yes, you can see one, two, three, four. Uh, the seasonal content, which you can purchase for both box and RCs. But then we have four. Um, which are known as what classes? This is an elite, legendary orange gear. Um, these you can only purchase with those RCs, and they cost a thousand RCs. Now, how much a thousand RCs are? I have no idea. Um, like I said, they gave me a thousand, so I bought this outfit because I like the look of it. Um, but yeah, it does seem as though there will be things exclusive to RCs. So if you want these. As far as I am aware, you ha will have to spend your real life money. I mean, you may be able to progress and earn RCs within the main game's campaign. I don't know that yet. It may be a possibility. Well, um, I know RC is definitely a currency you can purchase too. And then on the end, we've got six more items, which I'm guessing are seasonal as well. These you can use both your box and your RCs on. That's pretty... Actually, no, you can't. Five you can. The elite you can't. So I'm guessing elites are ones you purchase with RCs. That kind of makes sense. They are pretty badass. I like them. I like them a lot. Yeah, but yeah, guys, that's what we have and that's how it works within Riders Republic. So that is more or less the customization options we have. Um, yeah, I'm going to purchase that. Why not? I mean, it ain't like I ain't got the, the spare cheddar cheddar. So I'm never going to. You can put that on right here. So if I go to so and one outfits, exploration and toys, I can wear what I like now. So I can look like that if I want. Use that. Use that. Use that. Use whatever. It kind of looks like a Master Chief helmet, semi. <laughs> but yes, guys, that is the customization within Riders Republic, uh, as well as the monetization. You, I mean, to me. As long as it stays with just cosmetics only, I have no problem with it whatsoever. But as long as there's no pay to win here, I'm completely fine with it. But yes, that's what we know so far about the customization and monetization within Riders Republic. Let me know your thoughts on it down below. And hopefully guys, I will see you on the next video.